Say man, shout out to Amazon. Getting my stuff here. <coughs> Some jumper <jump> wire. <coughs> Got my little old chip. That's what that is, man. Part number, model number, that's what I got it from. But what we finna do today is make our own ALD cable, man, so I can read the computer to the Caprice. Oh, yeah, man. I got the battery toys in there, man. I done burnt the battery down, man, trying to get the lights and the dash back right. So, my, yeah, I haven't still, I still haven't figured out the problem of why it cuts off when I go right. Now, I said I was going to snatch out the alarm system, which I still might have to because there's just too many wires up under there, and I want to get as much as of everything up out of there as I possibly can. That way, I can figure out what's what, and then I can go back and, you know, plug up the alarm and do stuff like that. So, now, we need these. These some nice short ones. They're short, but they're going to work. So what we're going to do is, right here on the end, that last one is going to be the ground. I'm pretty sure you see the G-R-N-D. And these two are going to be um, two wires that we hook together. And those two wires, from the ground to those two wires together, are going to hook up to the A-B part of the ODB1 or A and M. You see the A and B or A and M. They're gonna plug up to that. You plug a mini USB into this, and that goes to a bigger USB, which is gonna go into my laptop. So you know, that's what we're working on right now. Hopefully I got the right cord for this because I'm not sure I got that cord. The mini US, that's the mini USB. I thought that was, yeah, I'm gonna have to figure out if I got this cord or not, but we're gonna make it work. If not, I'll be going to get one. But let me get on to this. I'm gonna get it kind of set up, cut it up out this bag. I'll cut it back on. This old laptop right here, boy, gave me so many problems last night. I mean, I done downloaded the eHack, I got Tuna Pro. All that on there, ready to go. Still don't work. So, and I think this only has Windows 8.1 on there or something like this. So, it's definitely not even, you know. So, excuse my bed, excuse my bed. Jumped out of bed, had to get to work. Um, What I want to say now is, had to get my son's laptop. Shout out to my son, man. Shout out to Junior Junior. I had to get my son's laptop and download the eHack and scan 9495, which is up now. The problem I had with my son's laptop is it wouldn't read the ports. It wouldn't read the ports that I needed it to read in order for... Okay, I got my keys in my pocket. It wouldn't read the ports in order for me to read that I had a cord in there as far as the ALDL that I created yesterday. So, I had to get my son's laptop just in order to see that it read the port. And where you see that COM3 select port, that means, oh, his ain't touch screen. That means <clears throat> it's reading my ports now. So, what we finna do is go get in the Chevy. And see if we can actually get it to pull some data log. So hold on real quick. Let's see if we can get out here and get a good data log. Mm. Give me a good scan. I'm probably gonna do this for the passenger side. Oh man, it's cold in this garage. It's like 21 degrees in Texas right now. You know, 
I'm in the Dallas area, so it's like 21 degrees, 28 degrees, something like that. Excuse the dough, man. Excuse the mess, too. This was a struggle yesterday, man. So, who is cold in here, man? Golly. I might need to go put on another jacket. It is definitely cold out here. Now, what we gonna do, we gonna hook this back up to the port. It's gonna go in the laptop. And hopefully, I'm putting it back in the same port that it said it was in a minute ago. So, we got that in there. Now, where are those wires? Oh, there goes one. Oh, no. Is that one? Is that a wire? No, they make the wires. Where are the wires to the ADL? Oh, maybe I snatched them out. Okay, I know the wires. The wires are in the house. Because I took them out last night with the ADL case that I made. I got two wires that I decided to use. Got the headlights fixed yesterday. I know I showed y'all in the video. Y'all should see that. That's probably going to be a part of this episode. I don't know if this one's going to be another episode, but hey, we'll see. Okay. Now, these wires, I'm going to put back together because those two go to the other situation. This one will go to that. So, hold on. I'm not sure if y'all can even see me. Set my camera down real fast. Do it real quick, easy. Twist of the wire today. Now, once I do get this to work out of the way, then of course I'll modify and make it better. Probably solder these wires together. That way it'll just be uh, um, complete cable. And I could just plug it up, hook it up whenever I'm ready. So, hopefully. Hopefully this works. Hopefully this works, man. This car has really been, let's say a challenge. I'm not going to say a headache. I'm going to say the car has really been a challenge. So, Got these two together. Now what we're finna do. Let me pick y'all up. Now what we're finna do. Take those. Back out of here. And we're finna plug these up. If I remember correctly, the ground goes on top. The other wire goes on bottom. Oh, okay. Now, this is going to be kind of difficult to do with one hand, so y'all bear with me, bear with me, bear with me. Now, my black one goes to the black, of course, to the ground. Nope. Black goes to black. Excuse my hand. Black goes to black. Okay, now I got two colors. I'm gonna put those together. These two right here, excuse me. I'm gonna put these two together, give me a second. Okay, got those two together. Now what we're gonna do is, I gotta plug these in down here. My connection port, which is down here. No, y'all can't see, but it's right, right here, right here, right here. Y'all can't see that though, but it's right there. So, let me get those plugged in, then we'll come back and do the data log, and I'll let y'all see that with me live. All right, all right, I brought it back with the light. Yeah, excuse the flow. Like I said, I'll. We're doing some wiring, but I got both of them in that port. On top, one bottom. Okay. We got a 
come three. And mind you, there's no more, so that's the one we selected. And grab my keys. Make sure I'm doing this right. And hopefully, this is going to do what it's supposed to do. Hopefully. Okay. Signal, uh, key turn forward. Believe we press connect, reset. Oh, it works. It works. It works. Okay. Everything works. I actually got a scan, people. So, what we're finna do now, though, um, we're going to start the car and get us a, um, a scan and try to save the scan to a log file. Um, so, in matter of fact, I'm actually finna, um, you see AC temperature, boy, that must say 20 degrees, Jack. So, we're going to, sorry for the glare, it's like a terrible glare there. Okay, there you go. Um, I don't see, I don't know, you know. Let me see. Let me reach over here and press the gas and see if, and I'm trying to turn y'all at an angle so I can lean down here and we're going to see if, Where's the throttle position? I see out of air control valve. Let's see if either one of those moves. Ouch. Okay. Uh, gotta lean a little bit more. I don't see my throttle position moving at all. Um, hmm. Let me reset and connect. Boom, just did it. Okay, we connected. But I didn't see my throttle position sensor moving at all. Um, yeah, I don't think I seen that move at all. And from my understanding, you could just press the gas while it's like this, and it should be able to move. Let's see. Let's swap the way we did this. Put it down right here. Press the wrong button. So. Um, idle air controls not moving. Throttle position not moving. Either one of those are moving. And from my understanding, it's at least supposed to move. It's not moving, though. Okay, maybe we got a problem. Maybe we have a problem. I say it's my first time using this, so... Mm. Gonna figure it out. Let me, let me do a little research. I'll come back in a second. These niggas is haters. These bitches be gossiping. And the one that they say they love you. Sometimes they be plotting on you to get it, you pay. First you to separate it. 